All right, Christy, thank you. It is election night in South Carolina and 7 News is your local election headquarters. Several local races will be decided tonight. And our Kelsey O'Donnell is live in Spartanburg County with more on how this day has been going. Fill us in, Kelsey. Well, it's been going pretty well, and voters, for the most part, across the upstate have a couple more hours to cast their ballot in this year's election. Now, several local election headquarters and officials have spoken with us and told us that, for the most part, things have run pretty smoothly outside of a few minor road bumps along the way. At 7 o'clock this morning, people gathered to cast their ballots. I am very excited about this election. In other words, you, uh, we have a voice, so this is the way that our voice can be heard. It's a day when people have the chance to be heard, casting their vote for local government, such as mayor, county and city council members, and even local school boards. I think all elections are important. You know, it's, it's a, a right we have in our democracy that a lot of people across the world don't have, and we should exercise that right when we have that opportunity. According to Spartanburg County's election director, Adam Hammond, only one minor issue is reported right now with one of the county's 98 precincts, a power outage, but it was back up in no time with little to no delays for voters casting their ballots. It's been a smooth day. Um, obviously, there's always the getting open in the morning is the hardest part. As far as Spartanburg County's voter turnout, election officials say there are more than 5,000 people casting their vote before 11 a.m., a count they're expecting to increase. Elections always have you know, low turnout, that's kind of the, the standard. We expect a 10 to 15 percent turnout. Uh, you know, might not get there, we don't know. That's kind of what, you know, these type of elections normally have. Obviously, we wish it was higher, but the people who are coming out to vote, we really appreciate that. In Anderson County, election officials say voting is slow and steady, while in Greenville County, at least one issue early this morning with a polling site going down, causing about a 20 to 30 minute delay. Election officials say everyone who was at the site successfully cast their ballot, whether that was on paper or electronically. Regardless of how people cast their vote, they're hoping those elected will bring change. Do what you can say you're going to do. Just don't come out here and say, vote for me. In other words, don't do what you say you're going to do. Stand for something. Now, polling sites in South Carolina are open until 7 p.m. in North Carolina, 730. So if you are in line by that time, you are guaranteed a chance to cast your ballot. For now, live in Spartanburg County, Kelsey O'Donnell, 7 News.